Hey guys, before we get into today's video, I just want to say a huge thank you to Tidewe for sending me some awesome hunting clothing to try out. This jacket is incredibly lightweight and quite warm. In this video, I wore it with just a hoodie underneath, and I believe it was about 40 degrees out, and I was very comfortable. It's water resistant. It has nine different pockets throughout the entire suit. It's breathable and warm. And on the butt, it has a wear-resistant Oxford fabric. So I will have links to this jacket and Tidewee's entire website in the description down below. And my personal favorite pocket on this entire jacket is the magnetic one. That's where my phone will be going from now on. It's November 13th, right around 6.15. It's just getting legal light out in the cornfield here. I have one deer already. I can't really tell what it is, but I don't think it's a buck. It is slowly working its way towards me though, so we have a massive cold front coming through today. This is what November dreams are made of. Should really get deer freaking moving.
of stuff in the way. And he was going to be quartering towards me just a little bit. And with, uh, with these houses being as close as they are, I got to make sure I have a great shot. All right, it is about quarter of two. My camera just started going off over at uh, at the old nursery property. The camera went off twice now. Deer seem to be uh, oops. Deer seem to be moving around in that bedding area where I got the camera right next to the tree stand. So it's still raining. I'm gonna try to make it down here, get everything ready, so that way as soon as this rain moves out, we can get in there. <clears throat> well, just got in. Got everything set up. I don't think I spooked any deer. It's really hard to hear anything, which benefits me mostly. That takes one of their senses away from them. So, camera hasn't gone some bucks on their feet. 